Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to name your ROMs correctly to ensure that they populate within uh, the HyperPy PC. So I have a, I'm in Nintendo Wii, and I have a test.wbfs, and I have a test.iso. Uh, these are just makeshifts to show you how this works. So let's say these were, uh, let's go into wheel. First thing you're going to want to do is go to the actual game that you have, uh, whether it be ISO or WBFS. And I'm going to say that my WBFS is Band Hero. So I'm going to want to copy the name of copy the name of the wheel and go back to my ROM. And I'm going to rename it. I'm going to paste it here. There we go. Press enter. And I'll do Let's try Back to the Future, the game, USA. So, copy that. Paste it here. Okay, so now they're named the same as the wheel art. So let's go ahead and uh, run our HyperPy PC. Go to. I'm just going to mute this. I'll mute that. It's loud. <clears throat> so let me just find my Nintendo Wii right here. Go into Wii, and there they are. They were named correctly. So you can see that my snaps are not named correctly. So I may not have the snaps for these games, um, or the box art or disc art. And this is all stuff you may have to find online. I've included everything I could find. So I don't have the video snaps, I guess, for these two games. Uh, to find out if I do, we can go into our ROMs. And we'll go down to Wii. Snap. And so I do not have the Back to the Future. And what was the other one? Band Hero. And I don't have Band Hero. So that's why those snaps aren't showing. But the games are showing. And that's how they populate. So hopefully this helps you guys out. Um, and it's it's that easy. Just ensure that your ROM name matches your wheel art. And you should be good to go. So again guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully this helps you out.